All right, ladies and gentlemen, y'all already know what time it is, man. If you like the video, like the video, subscribe for more daily 2K content, and let's get right into it. NBA 2K21, I know your shot is broken. Broken, yeah. Uh, look, man, we got the solution for you. I've got one of the top-rated shots by NBA 2K Lab. We're going to put it to the test, make a jump shot out of it, and, uh, and I've already done all of that, so you don't have to. And we're going to let you know about all of that right after this. Make it to C25, that's OG status I was told you could be anything, just don't be average Down bad, flat pipes, that shit made me sad Start hustling non-stop, don't plan on breaking that habit Alright, so just to show y'all real quick, man Look, last week I think I was at 64, something like that, 65 Now we're at 66.3% We're only rising uh, as far as the as far as the 2k beach and, and and the shots go and um i think last week in the wreck i was like in the i was like 49 and then wreck with now 57 percent so i'm just saying that to let you guys know that this jump shot has been vetted if you go back and watch my last jump shot video you'll be able to see well that's an awesome jump shot too but if you look at that last jump shot video you'll be able to see that my jump shot percentages have only gone up since last week and they're gonna keep going up and you know that, that's just how it goes because i don't put out any bad jump shots this is one of the best jump shots um via nba 2k lab i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys a jump shot right here in the video uh I'm not gonna drag it out I'm not gonna do any of that stuff man i just want y'all to get because i gotta get up out of here today i got too much work to do i got places to run to i got all this stuff to do so um i want y'all to see the jump shot and look at it and uh, you know, get it down. And if you don't do anything else, I know a lot of y'all gonna leave after this. So if you do leave after this, man, just make sure you drop a like on the video. It really helps me out. My notifications haven't been going out. My channel hasn't been growing. And like I said, bro, I've been on YouTube since 2009, 2010, beginning of 2010, doing Call of Duty streaming and stuff. I ain't got no break you through yet. And I think it's because people just don't like the video, man. It just is what it is. So if you like the video, like the video, subscribe for more daily 2K content. Let's get right into it. This is it. Jump shot three, release 134, release 14. 66% uh, percent toward 134. That's what I always do. That's what I've been doing lately. And uh, max speed. That's what I'm using, man. The reason I'm using this is because NBA 2K Lab said that this jump shot is the most highly rated, um, you know, for guys like like us like like bro you can't get like I, obviously if you have if you don't have a high jump shot you're gonna have trouble but if you're a big man you got restricted bases you got any of that stuff man this one has the highest make percentage like a 90 percent make with 12 percent white percentage so you are gonna be able to hit shots I, I went back to playstation and i played on my other guy and i didn't have on flexible release that was the only difference and i was hitting i was hitting with him i was hitting reliably if I'd have had on flexible release, I think I probably would have hit like two out of three threes, maybe something like that. So uh, I got to go back over to PlayStation. I have to do the video today, the differences that I've noticed between PlayStation and Xbox, because a lot of people wanted to know about that video. But um, like I said, man, big greens from half court. Look at that. This jump shot, one thing that you got to know is it's really quick. That's the one thing that you really need to know about it. Like, it's not as quick in here. Or oh, it doesn't seem like it's as quick in here but when you get out there on the court especially at max speed bro it is super fast look at that every time i'm almost late and like i said i'm late i'm late a lot of times because i use the shot stick right using the shot stick you're pulling the left trigger um at the exact moment but with this you're anticipating and then you're um with this you're anticipating with the button you're anticipating and when you're using the button it's like okay, I, I gotta I gotta let it go at the right time, and you know all the animation and not, and it's gotta register. So it's slightly different. Another thing is, it seems like they changed the shot stick this morning, like the areas where uh where things are, because like the zone that I'm pulling it down to right now that used to be center, it's not center anymore. So like I'm having to slide it just a tad to find out where it is, but like I, I think I pretty much got it now. Anyway. The, the way that you want to shoot this shot is as soon as you see his hand go flat or just before you see his hand go flat that's when you want to let it go as, and you have to really pay attention to it um you know that's what i that's what i do as as soon as i see it go flat that's when i that's when i do it and um when i'm doing it 
when I'm oiled up with it, bro, I'm, I'm telling you, I can shoot this thing from damn near anywhere. And the thing I like about it when I'm using the shots, that's a little late. The thing I like about it when I'm using the shot stick is I already know where I'm going to shoot it. I knew I did that too damn early. Um, I already know what I'm going to do when I, when I shoot it anyway. So it's like you just have to wait. Also, there's a little delay when you shoot with the shot stick like right here. You see how he went straight up? That's with the, um, and I knew I did it early. Um, that's, that's with the button. You see how there's no delay when I when when I shoot with the when I shoot with the button, it's like he just catches it and he goes directly up. Like I can't do that with the shot stick. Like even when the ball coming in, I'm holding it. But you see how he still has that little flinch, that little that little gather. You see what I'm saying? Like so you can't do it. That's the only thing that I really hate about any jump shot in this game. But like I said, hands go flat, or as soon as uh as soon as you see his hand go flat, or as soon as you see those elbows get up there that's when i normally do it and it really is one of the most consistent jump shots that i've had because like i said since i changed to this my my ratings i like you know once you get once your ratings get set in this game not your ratings but once your percentages get set in this game you you typically don't improve it really doesn't go up it normally stays but like it's like my, my joint is really trending toward uh 60 percent or something like that man it really feels like that so i'm gonna shoot like i said i'm gonna shoot some of these with the uh button and with the stick but the main reason that i use these releases is because these releases make more whites to me than any two releases i've ever mixed together in a game they did not work last year but this year they do like you just make a ton of whites add it to the base and it's just like uh add that with the base and flexible release and it's like people just really be like, bro, you just making nothing but white. And like I say it with like me and Bruda always say, I don't care if it's white or not. I mean, it go in, that's all I care about. So if you if you've got the shot down, you can get the shot down. Over here it just looks like the little pocket or whatever. But if you can get the shot down, you're gonna green it most of the time anyway. You're gonna just lock it in the muscle memory. And like I said, I'm just shooting with the, the button right now. You're gonna lock it in the muscle memory and you'll be good. But um you shooting with the shot stick. It's pretty much the same thing. It's, it's pretty much muscle memory. Once you see him going up, it's like so fast that once you see him going up, you just pull the triggers. And the thing is, like I was saying, when you shoot with the shot stick, you have to pull it, you have to pull the trigger at a different time and just because you're snapping the trigger, right? So because you're snapping the trigger, it's a little bit faster than when you see the, um, you know, when then releasing the button. So that's just how that goes. But anyway, like I said, this is one of the most, this is one of the better jump shots I've ever put together. And if I actually, if I actually concentrate on shooting it, probably can get some greens and stuff like that. But like I said, man, y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section. I um, I was gonna do some news today, but I really didn't get a chance to do news today, man, just because of the fact that um, I gotta go and I had to do a little work before I had left and stuff like that. And I, I, have, I, ain't, I don't have a real emergency. But a little emergency, you know what I'm saying? But if you got a big man, this will definitely... I'm not telling you that it's going to... I'm not telling you that it's going to be the difference between shooting 50% and 40% or something like that. But what I am telling you is that with this jump shot, you should be able to raise your shot percentages. If I could raise it from, from, from what was that, 65, 64%, something like that last week, 64.9%, to to 66.3 right now or whatever y'all should you should be it should definitely help you raise yours like i said i got a shooter and, it, and my percentage is still going up so if you don't it, I, and I tried it on my non-shooter on playstation and like i said it was it felt good i was able to hit threes from the top and stuff like that so just let me know what y'all think man if it works for you guys or not i never put out a bad jump shot ever and uh, it always helps somebody. So if it helps you out, make sure you like the video because the likes are directly tied to the notifications. If you made it this far, give me a gem star. And I'm going to holler at y'all next time. Till next time. It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK, the People's Champ. God speak. Commence. It don't make cash and it don't make sense Cause we can't pay rent with no one's opinion So in that sense, I never value your two cents Hey, darn, please leave that bullshit you speak at the barn Cause I ain't fine I'm only 5'8", that's fine, nigga I could give a heart transplant to a giant I ain't lying, I speak. We good